Hello, beautiful angel, if you are seeing this message, this message may be for you. As always, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. I'm going to pull a few cards just to guide you forward into this energy that you may be experiencing. This particular one doesn't feel like it's relating to love. It feels more like personal, I guess, to you, personal energy. There's a lot of beautiful cards coming out, so let's see. Okay, there's definitely a rebirth happening here or a new birth um, something new is taking place for you so the first cards to come out were the hermit and the world so this lets me new this again lets me know that this is personal to you this is your energy that we're talking about um, heavy introspection is coming through here so looking within um, discovering more from within than you ever could outside um, so this has to do with Kind of like facing what's coming through is facing the shadows of your self of your past it's like facing your it's like finally taking responsibility for what is yours and what is not and not only that but i'm being like the message i'm receiving is is clear um clear discernment of what is belonging to you and what energy is not belonging to you so it's almost like the separating of other shadows around you so that you can face your shadows and leave others to do their own shadow work with the world card here this makes me feel like you're giving birth to something new um so it's it's kind of like it feels mental it really feels mental it feels like it's all up here for you um, it's like a new mindset, like a new way of, of believing, of seeing, of living your life, of walking through this life. Um, with the Page of Wands and the Ace of Wands, again, this is like that fresh energy, like that young energy. Um, it almost feels like you're going to get like a wave of, of motivation or a wave of... Um, it feels like really gentle energy guiding you into what comes next for you with the ace of wands here and what this makes me feel like is freedom like this gives me the energy of just like total freedom um something that you've actually had to reach really deep within to pull out um this feels like multiple versions of yourself is is what you've overcome in order to kind of unlock this energy for yourself so it's not just a new beginning that you're unlocking but it's a new beginning that's going to basically lead to the life that you've always wanted to live and so when you imagine your dream life when you imagine what it feels like to wake up each day what it feels like to move through each day this is like your higher self is shining through here um i'm hearing you've been waiting a long time for this new beginning you've been waiting a long time for this life and I'm just getting like, <laughs> like I'm getting a feeling of like, just like good things, um, just like really good energy, like, like happiness, like realizing that you are everything that you wanted to be and that you have everything that you could possibly need and could even possibly imagine for yourself, like all of the good things. And when I tell you like, this is not the life that you've lived before. You've never lived a lifetime like you're about to live in this next chapter. You worked so hard to get here, is what I'm being told. Like, you deserve, you, you deserve to hear um, so much praise for what you've done, is what my angels are telling me. Um, I'm being told that you're so soft. Even after everything that you've been through, you're so soft. It's so crazy. So, my angels are telling me that the, it's like the most... The people who have suffered the most, the people who have experienced the most turmoil and um, sadness and pain um, and trauma are, and it's like you have the option to go one way with your life. You have the option to go many ways with your life, but the way that you've chosen is to come out on the other side of it so soft and so graceful and just so full of compassion and empathy for the world around you. I'm getting chills because it's like unheard of. <laughs> like going through what you went through and turning out the way that you did. 
It's really beautiful. I'm going to pull one more card just to give you, and it's 12-12 on the clock here. I'm going to pull, oh, okay, two more cards. Um, okay, so we have the Devil and the Six of Swords. You are silently, swiftly, silently and swiftly being led away from everything that no longer serves you. Silently and swiftly being led away from anything that has tried to control you or manipulate you. Any path that is not for you, you are being silently and swiftly guided away from that. And in fact, if you can relax into that trust and flow, it will... It's almost as if going to sleep and waking up and you're in a completely new place. Like you won't have to lift a finger, you won't have to do a thing. Like you can trust in a higher power to guide you away from and out of whatever it is you're not meant to be in right now. And 555 on the timer, including in love and relationships, especially in that. So don't worry. And just trust and let go. Like it's safe to rest now, it's safe to sleep. Like you can you can trust, you can relax, you can be in that soft energy that you've worked so hard to come to. And I'm just hearing the words like the devil doesn't scare me anymore. Because you've met yours. You've met yours. And you've faced yours. And so now you can proudly it's like proudly move forward, knowing who you are, what you're here to do, confidently trusting where it is you're going, and that good things are all that exist ahead. I'm gonna leave you with that piece. And as always, if you feel called to dive in further with me, I offer an arrangement of personal, um, sessions, including texting, questions, and video recordings, emails, all of that you can find in my um, website. You can click the link in my bio. And I'm here if you feel called.